Hello to all parents and students. I hope that everyone's break went well and for the ones that were not able to get, escape the two weeks of Arctic conditions, I hope that you were able to stay warm. Students and staff have been greeted with the tail end of the cold wind and rain on their return to school. I hope that our Year 6 camp goers keep themselves highly active to stay warm during their activities at Coonawarra this week. Firstly, I would like to congratulate all Junior and Middle School Award recipients and look forward to recognising the Senior School Student Achie High Achievers uh, early next week. Congratulations to our Year 9 students and teachers that completed the amazing expedition at Lake Elder National Park at the end of Term 2. Some amazing stories and photos have been shared with many staff about the growth and leadership that was displayed by many students. I know this experience will prepare the students better for the challenges life presents in the future. We are in full swing with subject and elective selections for our senior school students, happening over the next few weeks. Good luck to all students on their decision about what pathways they start to choose for themselves for the future. Please remember, senior school staff are very willing to help provide guidance and support to both students and parents during this process. Good luck to all students during their semester two studies and to all parents as we continue to work together to provide your child with the best possible education, care and opportunities for them to meet their full potential. If you have any questions or concerns, please do not hesitate to contact myself or any area principal to discuss your child's needs. Thank you for your ongoing support in making Hazel Glen College an amazing educational setting and a great place to work. I would like to close with paying my respects to our patron Adam Goods and recognise the connections in the recent documentary about him and reinforce the importance of treating all people equally and with respect, regardless of their gender, ethnicity, religion or culture, in line with the college commitment around respectful relationships. Thank you. I want you to put the blue balls in one bucket and the pink ones in the other one. Okay, it's time for your reward. Oh, yeah! yeah! Ready? Hands out. Okay, open your eyes. These aren't the same. Why not, Hannah? Because Logan's is so full and mine's not. Mine's like halfway full. Mine, mine is full and his is topping. There's less in here and there's more in there. Well, the reason that you got more, Lenny, is because you're a boy. Why? <laughs> That's unfair. <laughs> Why is it unfair? Because everybody should be treated the same way. Did you do the same work? The same job? Yes. yes. So we should both have the same amount. Even though you're someone else, you don't get more than another person. Because girls and boys are the same. same. The same respect. They didn't choose to be that gender, so we've got to respect them for who they are.